And to discuss this further, we're joined from Ankara by Mehmet Yegin. He's an affiliate at Bilkent University in the Turkish capital. Thank you for joining us, Mehmet. Tell us what, clarify for us, what is Turkey's position in all of this? Well, I, I think the Turkish position is, is to be understood by its uh, uh, long-term ally and, and uh, to be understood about what it means for Turkey. But for now, I think that there seems to be Turkey and the U.S. are on the different pages about how uh, explain, explaining the, how the things are going. So you talk about Turkey and the U.S. being on different pages. Tell us about these different expectations. Well, I think for the Turkish part, uh, the, the Turkey sees uh, uh, a 15 July coup attempt a major issue, and also it it, it thinks that there, there are people behind that and and the legitimate uh, procedure, legal procedure about that, and it expects from the U.S. to to respect that and at least. If not, the U.S. is uh, is assisting about it, but for the U.S. side, it's uh, it's a very different story. It thinks that the the evidences are not strong, so this is a harassment of the U.S. embassy personnel or the U.S. Uh, citizens. Mehmet, this is a. Uh quite a historic relationship and a long-term alliance between Turkey and the U.S. We've seen Turkey stand as a buffer against the Soviet Iron Curtain. Tell us historically, is there a precedence for what is happening today? Has, uh, has the relationship been through a crisis like this or previous crisis before? The relationship was not free of crisis any time, but, but this, is, this is a huge one, of course. But uh, the major crisis that I can recall uh, previously is, of course, the 2003 One March bill. That, that was a huge crisis between Turkey and the U.S. And it took likely four years uh, to, to recover for the bilateral relationship. So it was a long-term crisis, in, and I hope this will not turn out to be one either. Mehmet, given the history of the U.S.-Turkey relationship, what is the way forward or what is the way that you see is forward well i think that the, the crisis will stop at certain point and uh, and at uh, for some time i think there will be a silence and then then we will talk about uh, uh, third party uh, talks or then then one high level uh, visit to to one country to another then i think we we will go back to the to the to the uh, basics so uh, I don't think this will be, be a, 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 an end or broke uh, in a rift, major rift between the Turkey and the U.S. But I think it may take some time to, to, to just heal the, the, the wounds that, that the crisis has caused. Mehmet Yengen, thank you so much for joining us from Ankara.